Welcome to the Pelican Pursuit Review Show. We have a new sponsor for our review show, and that's Louisville Slugger. Uh, thanks to Mick, who is a rep for Louisville Slugger. In the 9U this weekend, the championship game is between the Delaware Vipers and the Delaware Rebels. Delaware Vipers won that championship 14-1, to and I really hate to say this, but Barsley picked that one. There was no MVP. The coach decided that the entire team should get the MVP. In the 11U, Mid-Atlantic Shockers Red versus Mid-Shore Bucks. Good little game. It ended up being 98, Mid-Atlantic Shockers Red. The Mid-Shore Bucks had a runner on third when they got the third out. They were trying to tie the game. And again, the Mid-Atlantic Shockers Red coach decided, no MVP, that the whole team should be the MVP. Way to go, Coach Chris. In the 12U, CT Hurricanes faced off against another Mid-Atlantic Shockers Red team. And in this case, CT Hurricanes pitching, apparently, according to Pete, shut them down 11-4, and the MVP of that was Dylan Reynolds. In the 13U, we had the Philadelphia Senators and the Central Bucks Wolf Pack. We had an all-Pennsylvania, Eastern Pennsylvania championship there. The Senators won that one, 7-1, and the MVP for that was their pit, the Senators pitcher, Joe Dumont. In the 14U, York Young Revolution and the Cape River Sharks. York Young Revolution won that one, 8-4, and the MVP was Taylor Lentz. And again, I hate to admit it, but Barsley was right on that one as well. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook and on Twitter, as well as YouTube. And I'll see you soon for the Coastal Clash preview show.